Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello, Destella, how are you today? Hello, Jenny. Hello, Claudia. Hello, Carla. Hello, Luis. Hello. Patricia. Hello, Patricia. Hello. Good evening, each of you. Okay, today um, we are going to finish uh, unit two and we're going to start uh, unit three. Okay, so um, let's go ahead and um, continue um, with the unit uh, exercise, the one we have from uh, unit two. So we're going to finish it today. Let's see, just give me a second so I can uh, get to the right, uh, just a second. One moment, please. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, sir. <coughs> Just a second. Okay, one moment. Let's, uh, okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna listen to an audio and uh, we are going to answer the question based on the, on the audio. And uh, this is, we're gonna listen to four people talk to a pharmacist. A pharmacist is the person who is in charge of the drug store, okay? So uh, four people are talking to him and we're gonna choose on each person's uh, problem. Uh, we're gonna select the answer. We're gonna have two answers in the first question. The man's uh, feet are sore or the man's feet are itchy. Uh, based on the audio, we're going to select uh, the correct answer, okay? So we're going to play the audio right now, uh, just a second. And let me know if you're able to hear it. Listen to four people talk to a pharmacist. Check each person's problem. One. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like something for my feet. I went on a long hike yesterday and my feet are really sore. I see. Why don't you try some of this ointment? You can put it on at night. It's very good for sore feet. I use it myself, actually. Okay, what is the man talking about? De qué es lo que está hablando el, 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 el cliente? Hello? His feet, his feet hurt. Okay. So is a, a, his feet uh, are itchy or his feet are sore? Sore. Sore. Are sore. Okay, very good. Feet are sore. Now let me see. Number two, we're gonna listen to uh, second people, second person. Two. Excuse me, I'm looking for something for a stomach ache. I see. How long have you had this problem? For a few days, and it's getting worse. I'll give you some pills to take for a few days. They should help. Take two of these three times a day with meals. Okay. Three. Where is a, what about the second person? <laughs> the woman can't eat? The woman has an upset stomach. The woman has an upset stomach. Does everybody agree? Todos uh, están de acuerdo? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, the woman has an, an upset stomach. Okay, very good. Now let's listen to the last one. Can I help you? Yes. I just came back from London on a long flight and I'm having trouble sleeping. We have several things for that, including sleeping pills. But I suggest you try some of this herbal tea. It's very good for jet lag. Drink some before you go to bed at night. Thanks, I'll try it. I don't like taking sleeping pills. Okay. Four. What is the, uh, the men's problem? The men has difficult 
the sleeping. man has difficulty sleeping. Yes. Okay. Okay, let's see number four. Good morning. What can I do for you? Um, I need something for a burn. I burned my hand a little when I was cooking last night. Look here. Oh, yes. I'll give you some cream for it. After you put on the cream, place a bandage over it for a few days. You should be fine. Thanks. Okay. The woman burned her, her hand. Burned her hand. Okay, the woman burned her hand. That's okay. Very good. Let's... Uh, Yes, yes, that's the correct one. So we got them all right. So that's uh, that's at uh, the end of uh, of uh, chapter two or unit two. Now we're going to start uh, unit three. On unit three, um, what's going to happen is we're going to learn about uh, uh, words uh, such as uh, words of agreement. When we say agreement, is when we um, accept something. Yes. So agreement is uh, eh, cuando usted acepta algo. Yeah? Y vamos a ver las palabras como so, to, neither, and either. Okay, so just give me a second. The, so uh, chapter three is going to be about those words. Okay, so los words, let's see, son agreement. Words of agreement. Okay. Esos son los words of agreement. Eh, y eso vamos a ver. So. Eh, to. Eh, neither. Y, um, either. Okay. So el, el neither. Eh, en, en español sería tampoco sería ni y tampoco tampoco eso eso sería el 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 neither ya yeah. ok so el so es as lo vamos a usar en, en diferentes escenarios y el tú también el tú tiene que decir también yeah. y el so así yeah. So, for example, if I say I like Japanese, Japan, Japanese, I like Japanese food. Yeah, a lot. Y cuando digo I like Japanese food a lot, yes, estoy diciendo. Me gusta la comida japonesa bastante. Yeah. A lot sería bastante. Yeah. I like Japanese food a lot. En el caso de Estela, bueno, Estela podría decir, um, so do I. So do I. Yes. Podría decir, so do I. I like Japanese food a lot. So do I. Yes, very good. Yes, yeah. so do I, dice Estela. Eh, Jenny podría decir también, I do too. I do too. Yes. Yeah. Entonces, esa sería agreement. Yeah. So do I. Es uh, también yo. Um, yo también. Y I do too. Yo también. Yes. Entonces los dos quieren decir lo mismo eh, en el caso de agreeing o agreeing, ¿verdad? Agreeing quiere decir estar de acuerdo, ¿ya? Y si no está de acuerdo, bueno, entonces dice, really, really, I don't. Ya, dice, I don't like, like it very much. Yeah. I don't like it very much. Yes. Really, I don't like it very much. 
I like Japanese food a lot, so do I. I do too, it's a, a green E. Really, I don't like it very much. Eso sería, Jenny sería not agreeing, ¿verdad? No estar de acuerdo. Eso sería not agreeing, cuando dice I don't like it very much. En este caso, uh, Carla, it, ¿qué es lo que está representando it? A la comida. A Japanese food, yes. A Japanese food. Estaría representando a Japanese food. Usamos los pronombres para no estar repitiendo el mismo oh, nombre over and over. So, so we are not repeating the name over and over. That's the reason why. Yeah. Okay, very good. Entonces, eso es, uh, es como agreeing. O Luis Alonso puede decir, um, I am crazy. I am... Uh, I'm crazy about, uh, uh, yeah, ice cream, ice cream. I'm crazy about uh, ice cream, yeah. Podría decir, I'm crazy about ice cream, yes. Eh, y puede decir, Gabriela, puede decir también, ¿cómo diría usted, Gabriela? Para, para decir que está de acuerdo, que sí también. So I do. No, porque como le dijo, I am crazy about ice cream. Entonces, ¿cómo va a contestar usted? Eh, so, am I? Yes, so am yes. I. Yes, so am I. Yes. Mm -hmm. So am I. Yeah, como le, le dijo, I am crazy about ice cream. So usted va a contestar, so am I, so am I, yeah, so am I. O de qué otra forma puede decir, Claudia? So, I do too? I do too, yes, ajá. Uh -huh. Pero no I do, ¿verdad? Porque está, no, está, no, está, no está usando el, el do, entonces. Me too. Okay, I am um, two. two. Yes, I am two. Yeah. Como le estaba diciendo, I am crazy about the ice cream. Entonces usted dice, I am two. Puede decir me too, ¿verdad? Pero como estamos aprendiendo acerca de estas words of agreement, Estamos, uh, we are learning about those words. That's the reason why you're using I am too. Oh, so am I. Yeah. Uh, so we're trying to use a different uh, uh, vocabulary besides me too. Yes, because me too, you, you hear that uh, word uh, being used a lot. Me too. Okay. So, vamos a ver otro. Uh, I can, I can eat, eat uh, uh, really, really spicy, spicy, spicy food. Yes, I can eat really spicy food. This a, this a Patricia. Yes. Yes. Patricia says I I can eat uh, really spicy food. Y Luis Enriquez. ¿Cómo dice para, para agree con ella también? ¿Cómo diría para a, a estar de acuerdo con ella? Luis Enrique. Eh, so, can I. so can I, ¿verdad? So can I. Can I. Yes. So can I. Yes. So can I. Puede decir. O de qué otra forma Rufino podría contestar usted. Cuando dice, I, uh, I can eat really spicy food. I can too. I can too, yes. I can, can too. too, yes. I can too, yes. Yo puedo también, yes. I can too. Y si diría que 
Olivia, ¿cómo diría usted que no puede? I can eat really spicy food. Yo no puedo. ¿Cómo diría? I, I don't... I can... Yeah, solo I can't. Yeah. I can't. I can't. I can't. Yes, I can't. Solo diría I can't. Mm -hmm. I can eat really... I can't uh, eat really spicy food. It is it? I can't. I can't. Yeah. All right. Ahora vamos a ver uh, cómo usar el, el neither o el either. Yes. Que eso es para decir que eh, tampoco, ¿verdad? O ni. En el caso vamos a decir I don't. I don't like greasy. Greasy food. I don't like greasy food, dice, dice Carla. Y Jenny le contesta que ella tampoco. ¿Cómo le contestaría Jenny? I don't like greasy food. Y Jenny le contesta. Ok, Jenny está ocupada. Rodrigo, ¿cómo le contestara? I don't like neither. Ok, I don't like greasy food y diría neither. Uh, do I. Neither do I. Yes. Neither do I. Neither do I. Yeah. Neither do I. O de qué otra forma le podría contestar, Rodrigo? Rodrigo. I don't like neither. Okay, I don't either. Yeah, I don't either. Yeah, Entonces, I don't like greasy food. Neither do I. Oh, I don't like uh, greasy food. I don't either. Yeah, Entonces, I don't either. Es como. Uh, a mí tampoco, yes. Y el otro ese, yo tampoco, yes. Mm. I neither do I or I don't either, yeah. Y si, y si lo queremos decir, y queremos decir lo contrario, I don't like easy, uh, greasy food. Oh, puede decir alguien, oh, I like it a lot. Yeah. Oh, I like it a lot. Yeah. Eso sería lo contrario, ¿verdad? Lo contrario de um, agreeing. Eso sería disagreeing con la persona que dice, I don't like greasy food. Neither do I. Agreeing. Y el otro, I don't either. O oh, el otro, oh, I like it a lot. Yeah. Oh, I like it a lot. Eso sería. Ok, ¿estamos bien ahí? Yes. Ok. Voy a borrar esto. Ok, y vamos a ver una vez más. Vamos a ver, I am... I am not, en este caso no estamos usando el do, sino que el verbo to be, I am not in the mood uh, for Indian food. Indian food. Yes. They say, uh, Paola dice, oh, I'm not in the mood for Indian food. En otras palabras, ella dice, ah, no, no me siento como que quiero comer la comida india, ¿verdad? I'm not in the mood. Cuando decimos I am not in the mood, es que no me siento como que quiero comer eso, ¿verdad? I'm not in the mood for Indian food. Ese sería. Entonces, uh, eh, ¿cómo le contestaría José Vega a esto? I'm not in the mood.
I'm not in the mood for Indian food. Acuérdense, bueno, estamos usando el, el neither y el either. Yes. Ajá, uh -huh. neither. Ok, sería neither. 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 Como le dijo, I am not. Am I? Yes, neither am I. Yes, neither am I. Yeah. Neither am I. Yes, eso está agreeing, eh, pero en, en caso de negativo, ¿verdad? I am not uh, in the mood for Indian food. Oh, neither am I. Yes, neither am I. O, ¿qué otra forma podría contestar, Paola? Uh, neither. No, ya contestamos uh, neither. Either. Sí, ¿cómo contestaríamos? Vean los apuntes I que tienen. Either. Ajá. Sí, ¿cómo sería? I am either. I am not either, ¿verdad? I am not either. Esa es la forma como contestaría en uh, agreeing a la statement que dijo I am not uh, in the mood for Indian food. Neither am I. Sería. Y el otro sería I am not either. Y si usted está, está en, en contrast, o sea, no está agreeing con esa persona, puede decir, really, really, I am. I am. Eh. Yo sí, dice, yo sí. Eh. Podría decir Rufino, oh, really, yo sí. Yo sí, quiero probar la Indian food, yes. Pero eso sería no agreeing, ¿verdad? No, not agreeing con esa persona. Ok, entonces ya vimos uh, las words of agreement. El so, el to, el neither y el either. ¿Alguna pregunta? ¿You have any questions regarding to these uh, uh, words of agreement? Teacher, neither... Yes. Neither and either. Uh -huh. um, se ocupan only when the neither, when is the, the negative. As well, is negative is yes. at the beginning. Yes, when the neither. question when the question is the, the question negative. Is, is negative. Mm -hmm. And the either is when the question is negative y, y va al final. At the end yeah. of it, yes. Uh -huh. okay. Yes, okay. at the end. I am not. Usted hace la negation, hace la negación y yes. le pone either. Tampoco. Okay. Yo tampoco. Yes. Y el otro es tampoco yo. Yes. Sí. Ok. Neither am I. Ok. Y el so se usa para las positivas. Positivo. I like, yes. I like um, uh, Italian food a lot. So do I. O yes. I do too. Yes. Para eso se usan, para cuando está haciendo una, un statement, a positive statement. Ok, thank you, teacher. Ok, very good. Ok, entonces, uh, si no hay ninguna pregunta, vamos a, a, a leer. Let's see, we're going to read, uh, uh, let's see, chapter three, just a second. One second. Let's see. One moment, please. One second. Ok, 
Okay. Oh, I like it a lot. Okay, let's see. This one is uh, um, where we're gonna, uh, we're going to practice the words that we have just learned. Uh, neither, either, to, and so. And I'm gonna read it for you first so you can uh, uh, learn the uh, pronunciation of the different words. And it says, uh, it says like this, uh, say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure, where do you want to go? Well, what do you think uh, of Indian food? I love it, but uh, I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, yes. I guess uh, it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific, let's go. So we're using the words of agreement, uh, uh, neither, que está um, de, uh, poniéndose de acuerdo en una negativa, y eh, I do too, que está en positiva, ¿verdad? Cuando le dice um, the Japanese food, eso es positiva, y le dice, oh, I do too. Y el I'm not uh, either, eh, sería la negativa. Ok, vamos a tener a Rufino y Andrea Renderos. <coughs> Rufino va a ser Jeff y Andrea Renderos va a ser Bob. O si puedo tener a José Vega y a Rodrigo Ernesto. José Vega va a ser Jeff y Rodrigo Ernesto va a ser uh, Bob. Bob, ok. Quiero leer, chef. Ok. Oh. ¿Con quién me toca? Eh, ahorita tengo José Vega con Rodrigo Ernesto. Cuando terminen ellos, le doy otra persona, ok. Ok. Uh, ok. Uh, sure, sure. Where do you want to go? José, no se escucha, no escucho. No te puedo escuchar. Lo escuchas tú, Rodrigo. A little bit, teacher. A little bit. Yeah. It's the same. Okay. Yeah, I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Terrific. Let's go. Terrific. Let's go. Terrific. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. Now switch places. Okay. Say, would you like to go? No. Sorry. Okay. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. How do you like Japanese? Uh, oh, I like it a lot. I 
Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Okay, thank you. Okay, very good, excellent, good job, okay. Okay, Andrea, in, um, let's see, who else do I have here? Jenny Sanchez, okay, Andrea and Jenny Sanchez, please. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Mm -hmm. Sure, where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's, it's a, a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I always want to go there. Terrific, let's go. Okay, yes. Oh, I've always wanted, wanted. Porque es, una, es, es un pasado de want. Entonces tiene que decir wanted. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Okay, let's switch places, please. Okay. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure, where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Airoha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Good job. Okay. Claudia Iraeta in... Uh... And Tatiana, play test, please. There's one. Yes. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think for Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Mm, yeah. I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Airoha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay, very good, very good. Excellent. Now let's switch places. Say, would you like to go? Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I know either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific, let's go. Very good, excellent, good job, good job, excellent. Excellent uh, um, pronunciation and uh, good fluency, very good. Okay, I would like to hear the Luis Alonso and Luis Enrique, please. Okay, say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure, 
where do you where do you want to go well what do you think of indian food um, i love it but not really in the mood for it today yeah i am not either i guess it's a bit spicy mm. how do you like chinese food japanese Ah, uh, Japanese food, sorry. <laughs> oh, I yeah. like it a lot. I do too. And uh, I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Very good, very good. Let's switch places. But uh, uh, Luis Enrique, try to be more natural. The, you're too too stiff. Estás muy tenso. Ya yeah, trata de, de, de relajarte, ¿ok? Eh, para que se oiga más natural cuando lees. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Say, would, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I am not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Hiroha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay, very good. Um, tengamos cuidado en la eh, Alejandra Magaña, sí, um, ahorita. El, los, los pasados. Por ejemplo, um, Luis, aquí donde dice, it's called Airoja. O sea, no es call it, ¿verdad? It's called, called. called. Se ve como una D al final, called Airoja. Called. Yes. Y um, donde todos están teniendo problemas es donde dice, I love it, but I am not really in the mood for it. Yeah. No, 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 no tenemos que cortar donde dice, in the mood for it today. No, sino que es for it for today. It. today. Entonces, for yes. it es, uh, es la palabra, eh, es la, la pronunciación correcta. For it today. No la corten Oops. for it today. Yeah, sino que for it today. En esas dos, ¿ok? Y los pasados, tengamos cuidado en las terminaciones ed. Called. Okay. Called. Called, yes. Very good. Other than that, uh, it, it was pr pretty good. Cold. Además de eso, estuvo bien, ok? Very good. Ok. Y me levantó la mano. Me, teacher. Yes, este. Y Gabriela Cortés, por favor. Yeah, go ahead, please. Um, okay. So, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but um, I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called, call it Iroha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific, let's go. Okay, very good. Remember it's called, no call it, called, called. Si, si se le, le cu les cuesta hacer ese sonido, entonces póngale como una A al final 
y, y se va a escuchar call the, call the. Call, call the. the, yes, pero no call it, ok. Call the, uh, call the iroja o airoja. Ok, very good. Now let's uh, switch places. Ok. Uh, say, would, say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah. I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay, very good. Ahora, um, Señorita Gabriela Cortés, repita después de mí. It's called Airoja. Called Airoja. Yes, very good. Ahora, la otra señorita, repita después de mí. It's called Airoja. It's called Airoja. Very good, very good. Yes. Para que vayamos a, a practicando esas terminaciones de ED. Yeah, no hay que decir call it. Ok, very good. Ahora, um, Olivia Osorio y Paola María, please. Say, would you like to go... Perdón. Say, would you like to go our to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. Uh, it is a big space. Mm. How do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I be always going to, to go there. Terrific, let's go. Okay, very good, excellent. Olivia, and vamos a leer donde dice, yeah, I'm not either. Diga, yeah, yeah. I'm not either. Yeah. I'm not either. Yes, y después dice, uh, it's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. Yeah, it's a bit spicy. Y la otra es abajo donde dice, oh, I've always wanted to go there. Oh, I, al I always I wanted. I always wanted to go there. Always want to <laughs> repeat, please. Yes, I always wanted to go there. Oh, I will, I always I want to go there. Okay, I always wanted to go there. I always I, I always wanted to to go there. 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 Yes. I always wanted to go there. I always wanted wanted to go there. Yes, así como dijo primero, wanted, no wanted. Yes, wanted. wanted. Yes, wanted to go there. Very good. Y señorita Paola, eh, well, it's called Airoja, called Airoja. It's called Airoja. Yes, uh -huh. no call it. 
college, no existe la palabra college, ok, very good, excelente, ok, vamos a tener um, a la señorita Estela Lara y Patricia Verónica, please. Ok, say would you like to go out, out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not in there either. I get it bit, it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like like it a lot. I do too. And I know the nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Ter terrific. Let's go. Okay, very good. Excellent. Uh, let's switch places, please. Um, Say, say, would you like to go to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the food for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit, it's a bit spicy. How do you like Japan, Japanese food? Oh, I like I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near, near here. It's called, called Iroha. Oh, I be always wanted want to go there. Okay, it is oh, I've always wanted to go there. I've, I've always wanted to go there. I've always wanted to go there. Yes, very good, excellent. Okay, see if I can have uh, Claudia and in, um, in Tatiana play test, please. Again. Yes. Say, would you like to go to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not neither. I guess it's a bit this. How do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Airoha. Oh, I always want to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay, very good. Excellent. Let's switch places, please. Okay. Would you like to go? Would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it tonight. Today. Yeah. Today. <laughs> yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Well, I like it a lot. I do too. I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Good job. 
¿Hay alguien que me falte de la lectura? Carla, ¿ya pasó usted? ¿Carla Verónica? ¿No? Mi, no. mi teacher, but uh, I don't, uh, I don't, uh, I, I, I almost participate because in the, I am uh, studying in my, my telephone mobile is Uh -huh. more in this week because uh, um, I hope in the next next week participate uh, because I I don't I don't I don't uh, uh, I, I am here in this moment in in uh, I am in Ecuador. Okay. Okay. Okay, not a problem. Okay, Luis Perez then in, uh, in uh, let's see, and Carla Veronica, please. Teacher. Yes. Solo que es que he tratado de estar practicando, pero sí algunas palabras me cuestan. Tranquila, por eso es que, por eso es que quiero que practique. <laughs> yes, entre menos, entre menos uh, le salgan las palabras, mejor más hay que practicar, ¿ok? No se preocupe, tranquila. Si se equivoca, no pasa nada. No pasa nada. Ok, go ahead, please. Iniciaría yo. Sí, please. Say, would you like to go uh, to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it tonight. Mm, yeah, I know either. I ask you my question, teacher. Okay. I'm not either. I guess it's a bit I guess spicy. It's a I guess it. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess, guess it's. It's a bit. Bit spicy. Spicy. Mm -hmm. mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too, and I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Very good. Very good. Excellent. Sí, se puede. Sí, puede. Okay, now switch places, please. Okay. Say, would you like to go to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay, very good. Excellent. Good job. My goodness. Sounds very good. All right. Okay. So um, if if you're not reading, uh, you're not practicing. So don't be afraid. Don't no, no tenga miedo leer. Yeah, you're gonna make mistakes, but uh, um, the more you read, the more confidence you will become. So, no tenga miedo. El, entre más lee, más a, a gusto se va a sentir cuando lea. Eh, cuando haya la oportunidad de leer, eh, aviéntese. Jump into the water. So, start swimming. Tírese el agua, empiece a, a nadar para que pueda después eh, sentirse 
Bien, ok, esa es la idea. Ok, we're going to do the exercise uh, from the, uh, um, the platform. Let's see. The exercise about uh, the uh, uh, agreement with statements. Uh, do not use periods on your answer. No vamos a usar uh, puntos en las preguntas, en las respuestas. Entonces, la primera dice, I'm not crazy about French food. ¿Y cuál va a ser la respuesta aquí? I'm not either. So I'm not crazy about French food. Es negativo. Entonces, ¿cuál vamos a, 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 us, a usar? Neither, I'm I'm right. neither am I. Neither, yes. Neither. Neither am I, ¿verdad? My. Neither am I. Neither am I, yes? Neither am I. I can eat any kind of food. I can too. I can too? Okay. Yes. Okay. I can too. All right. Vamos a probar esa. I think Mexican food is delicious. So do I. So do I. So mm. do I. Okay, I can't stand greasy food. I can't either. I can either, yes, I can either. Okay. I don't like salty food. Neither do I. Neither do I. Neither do I. Okay. I am in the mood for something spicy. I am too. I am too. I am too. Okay. I'm crazy about uh, Korean food. So am I. So am I. So am I. Okay. I don't enjoy fast food very much. Neither do I. Neither do I. Okay. I don't enjoy fast food very much. Oh, I'm sorry. Este es acá. Neither do I. Acá. Es so am I. Neither do I. Acá es so am I. So am I. Yeah. Neither do I. And number nine, this is I always eat healthy food. So do I. So do I. So do I. I do too. I do too. Yes. I can't yes. eat seafood. I can't either. I I can't either. Yeah. Podemos decir neither 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 I can't, ¿verdad? También. Vamos a ver en qué nos equivocamos aquí. Sacamos esta mala, ok? I can't stand uh, greasy food. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Neither I can't. can I. Le faltaba la, la apostrofe A. Esa. Vamos a ver. Yes. I can't either. Yes. Le faltaba la apostrofe eh, eh, con la 10. Ok. Ok, entonces. We got them all right. Very good. Yeah. We did a good job, ¿sí, Carla? Verónica, todo se puede, ¿ah? ¿eh? Ok, so, ya las tienen, ¿verdad todas? Yes. Ok, very good. Excellent. Good job. I'm very proud of you guys. You did a wonderful job uh, this evening. So, keep up the good work. And um, that's it for tonight. And I see you tomorrow. If you don't have tomorrow, teacher. Oh, yeah, nice night, okay. teacher. Have a good night. Have a good night. Have a good night. I love you. Bye bye. bye.